Okay, we're back on again. I'm really sad that I lost that last video. It was like 10 minutes riding up from Times Square to Central Park. So again, I don't know if you can hear me, but I am now going to go back. Now I'm going to go from Central Park to Times Square. My friend is not going to come. And justifiably so. I don't blame him, considering how many people are out and he's taking every precaution. So I'm going to go out and just try to scream to the phone because I don't know if it's going through the Bluetooth or through the camera. I think it's going through the camera, so I'm just strapping up. I had a rest and now I'm going to ride. I lost the video because it didn't upload and I don't see it. And that's too bad because we encountered a lot of stuff. But I'm going to try to go back somewhat the same way. And here I go. So I think you guys can see me. It should be mounted okay. I'm about to start. There we go. Which way to go. I'm going to go all the way to Times Square and catch the elevator on 49th Street, which only goes towards Queens. When you come to the city, there's no elevator. Now, does that make any sense at all? I guess in New York it does. Uh, we're live now in New York City, Central Park, and I'm riding around the footpaths, which are really supposed to be for people walking. But this is a fold up bike, it's very small, uh, 20 inch wheels. I think it's fitting an overhead rack. There's people playing on the rocks. The kids are climbing the rocks. Not as easy to respire with a mask on. The job. Nobody's coming up with some music on their bicycle. It's really quiet though. Of course. I'm going to climb the circle again. I lost that video and I don't like that I lost a video by going live. I mean obviously it's out there somewhere. But it's not on my phone. And it's not in a post. So it's like live but not saved. He's got too close. Uh, there's less people now than before. A lot less people. Let's try to get the circles you can see. Okay. 
Let's go see the world in front of the more Trump International Hotel and Tower. Yeah, pretty funny hearing him say that all his hotels are open. I thought he wasn't allowed to be running any businesses, friends. He was talking about him like he's day-to-day -day contacts with them. What he decides and such. So, there it is. Low President. Hopefully he doesn't break any laws. Fine. So very interesting. I haven't been out here in a while. I stroke five years ago. Let's go. Yeah, Trump International Tower. Hotel. Hey, it's Columbus Circle. Time Warner. Name of the gangster who got shot here. Christopher Colombo. Okay. That's the city is not too cleared out. You know, on Saturday it's gonna be quiet anyway. I'm gonna go by you. Thank you. Okay. Say bad. I was told it in my you lingo to use the word weak. Not bad. Not bad or good. Uh, well, I hate to say it, but a word doesn't change things. It is what it is. Well, I hate that. That's it. There we go. Uh, 
now. Uh, New York has all these inclines. Sidewalks are pretty clear. Oh, the plan is a hotel. Todd English. Oh, thanks. Gotta go down Fifth Avenue. Holy Christ, it's empty. Look at Fifth Avenue. This is ridiculous. All right, you gotta see this. All right, it's not ridiculous, it's actually smart. I'm going that crazy. Look at this. Can you believe it? It's never empty here. This, this Apple store is 24 7. This is where I get all my iPhones from, except for the last one, this one now, that I lost. Got it on Micro Center. This is incredible. This is empty. It's not Christmas. It's not. <laughs> I mean, that's the major holiday, Christmas. Look, here I am, riding, red light, not supposed to. Oh, oh, oh. Thank you. Look at this. Oh man, it's like I'm ready for a parade or something, but it's a parade and this is going to last. Now this is not supposed to affect the world. Temporarily closed. Temporarily, every day, hundreds of billions of dollars in revenue occurs and that's all stopped. Hundreds of billions. We're going to lose trillions. Look at this, I'm crossing over 57th Street. Look. I'm going to do a figure eight on 57th Street. Look at this. And the light hasn't even changed. Oh my God. I am doing donuts on 57th Street. I'm doing donuts on 57th Street on Saturday afternoon. That doesn't even happen on Christmas. All right? Oh, I don't want to get killed by a bus. Oh, he's right behind me. I didn't mean to do that. Go to the right. He's coming up past me anyway. All right, Winston. Oh, what does it say now on the phone? Hold on. Low battery. Okay, well, I'd have to charge it. Let's see, I'll, I'll go to Rockefeller Center and I'll charge it. And then I'll go 55th. Yeah. 
Wow. It is really quiet here. This is like tourist haven here. This is where everyone comes. They walk these streets. I've seen this here. It's so packed, so mobbed. People with it were within inches of each other, going in both directions. Oh my God. Back up. All right, 20% battery. Take a look down the street. Look, this is a main cross town thoroughfare. Look. Okay, now it's starting to get a little bit like I am legend. Okay. I mean, these people exercising and tour, touring for all you safe in your home. And that's what I do. I gotta say, this thing hasn't really affected me much because I stay in a lot being disabled and uh, living a disability I can't spend money I don't have to spend so what you may think I got money I don't so I have to stay home so there really hasn't been much difference with that except I have to wear a mask take precautions I'm not that close to me but otherwise, and psychologically, I could tell you all about this. You know, instead of me having a stroke, the whole goddamn world just had a stroke. And it, it's gonna recover, but never fully. You know, St. Patrick's Cathedral, we just had the bells chime. Now look, I'm gonna cross the street. One car at the light, one. Now, here's somebody. Um, homeless or praying? Oh, she's homeless. Wish I had change to give. Just has tumor. Christ. Ugh. Not good. Well, crisis makes change. And some of the worst things that happen in the world make the best of people the best of them oh there's radio city look i could just stop on the middle street like this and just hold it it's eerie it's eerie it's not like saturday night because we're not in a small podunk town okie from muskogee out in the middle of the heartland which i love by the way since i crossed the united states five times over with a car a friend and stayed at people's houses and had dinner with them. Met all thousands and thousands of folks in every single state, almost. But this New York City, it never sleeps. Let's just take a look at St. Pat's. I'll raise the bike. There it is. And the police are there. We're going to keep going. Oh, yes. That was, you've got the world on your shoulders. See that? Okay. Let me see that gear for this. Yeah. Me and my crew. Me, myself, and I. Shooting, recording, shooting audio, riding. Okay, let's see. Green light. Watch out for the traffic. Don't get hit. Oh no. There's a car coming. Bam. Not happening. <laughs> Not happening. So. Surreal? Well, not for me. Having worked during 9-11, I didn't get to do any tourism or have fun and look at things. I had to work and do a service to the people to show them and tell them the news. Because we were the ones who had it in our hands to do so. It was our duty. This sex. No nation is immune to a virus, a pandemic. 
the flag is for us, but not to separate us from the world, just to be another group that will help each other within and out. Oh. Man, this is real. So, uh, mentally I'm not affected by it. In the beginning I was, I realized, I took note, it's gonna get bad. And of course I also fear for myself. I don't wanna end up in ICU. I know what the hell that's like. And uh, I certainly don't wanna have friends, loved ones, anyone, family be affected by this. I don't wanna hear about that, but I do know how fragile we are as life, and that we could go at any time. That I know very well. I always have death on my mind. I think a great warrior said that. Okay, let's uh, move faster. I was supposed to stop and recharge, but I think I got a little bit of battery. If it goes dead, I'll stop. Okay. So, look at this. Look at this. Saturday afternoon and a nice warm spring day. Everybody goes out during the spring. Nope. We have to stay in. Eventually the summer will come and it will slow down infections if we control it in other ways. But the virus will move to the south, southern hemisphere as it gets cooler and it completely infects the southern hemisphere. So they need to take those precautions seriously now to help them. Also, it's a much less population. But we will have a second wave in the fall, which could be very dangerous, but may not take precedence in the news. The second wave could be really bad. There's nowhere to go to rest, nowhere to go to warm up. Oh, oh I'm going to take a detour before I go home. I'm going to take us to Grand Central Terminal. Let's do that. Let's ride to Grand Central Station. We all know what Grand Central Station is. When we make fun, when we have people over, or parents showing their kids, bringing their friends up, what do you think this is, Grand Central Station? Let's see how busy it is in Grand Central Station today. Oh yeah, I got strong legs. Jeans. Family professional football. Oh, that's closed. Sidewalk closed, use walkway. Let's try this. Okay, it's Grand Central Station here on my left. And I'll go inside too. I'll have to walk up the bike. Okay, there's a little bit of a bump here. be open. That's a cool place to gamble apartment. <clears throat> oh. Okay. Coming in front of Grand Central Station. Oh my god, the doors are open. Of course they are. Oh my god, I'm gonna do something. Maybe I shouldn't be doing it. But I'm gonna do it. I hope you guys are with me. And I hope it stays on. Here we go. Probably gonna get in trouble for doing this. Let's see. At least you guys will see it before I get arrested. Whoa. Oh, I'm down below. Okay. Gotta go back up.
There it is. Okay. I hope I'm transmitting. Guess where we are. My favorite movie is North by Northwest. Okay, before I get in trouble, I'm walking. I don't want you to see the stars. Look. Look at the stars. They're all backwards. It's intentional. Alright, so there are people here. I'm gonna walk it. Not too many. It looks really clean. It's all shiny. Oh. Okay. This is real, folks. This ain't a movie. This is real. And we're live. Wow. Look at Orion. It's backwards from looking in. Yeah. Um, I am not going to take those stairs where the police are. So, the interaction booth. I am gonna. I'm going to take a charge my battery. I'm gonna sit somewhere and charge my battery before I go on. Let's see. I doubt I can sit on the steps. This is amazing. Unlike any other feeling, it's a half open, half closed. There's no pinches. here. There's no benches. Let's see what I can do. I may have to just sit on the floor. Oh, the bench is a cordoned off. No trespassing. All the benches are closed. They don't want you to sit here. Okay. See? Benches are closed off. Okay. Let's see what I can do. I'm going to take a seat here. I'm going to stop the video so it uploads and saves and goes HD. Hope you can hear me. I'm going to say bye for now. And I'll be back on, I don't know, 20 minutes or so. Charge the battery, and I'll show you what it's like to head home on the subway, if I can. Here we go. Bye.